What is going on guys, this is the Walkthrough King, and today on Black Ops 3 there's a pretty big update which introduced contracts as well as four new weapons. This gameplay is of one of the weapons, the Banshee, which is a energy shotgun, which is pretty neat. And of course, as always, they are in the black market, and so chances are it's going to take you quite a while to get these weapons unless you purchase a ton of COD points, or unless you do what I did and saved up a ton of crypto keys and just use the ball at once when the new updates with weapons come out. Right into the contract system, there's a daily contract, and then there's a weekly contract. The daily contract for today is to get 10,000 score, which will give you 10 crypto keys. And the weekly contract is to win 20 games and get 50,000 score, which will net you 30 crypto keys in one mercenary contract. The mercenary contracts are used to redeem Blackjack, which is the new specialist that they introduced, and that will allow you to use him for one hour. In my opinion, the contract system is extremely underwhelming. It is... The rewards so far are garbage. I hope they make the rewards a lot better. And the mercenary contract... Only getting one per week to be able to use blackjack once per week for an hour. That is insane. That is really, really stupid. I don't know why they set it up that way, and I hope they change that in the future. And possibly maybe move that mercenary contract out of the weekly contracts and move it into its own category where, I don't know, just something better than what they have set up now. So that's really all there is to the contract systems. I'll go a little bit more in depth on the new weapons now. They introduced the Banshee, which is the one the gameplay is of again. And then they also introduced the Rift E9, which is the energy pistol, which is burst fire, I believe. And I'll have a picture of each weapon up. They, for the two melee weapons, they introduced the buzz cut, which is a, it looks like a piece of wood with a saw blade on the side of it and for the final one they introduced the nightbreaker which is a really weird looking weapon i'm not really sure how to explain it but you'll see it from the picture that's pretty much it to describe from this update though i'll have the patch notes in the description again as there's a ton of things and i don't really want to get into that in this video i just want to to make this a short video with gameplay of the new weapons one of the new weapons Anyways, I will also have gameplay up of Blackjack as well as the other DLC weapons later today. For the rest of this video, I will just have the raw gameplay of the weapon being used. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the next video. One more thing before I go, I will be uploading a new series of my progress to getting Dark Matter, as well as have a bunch of new zombie content posted, some of which is probably all over the place already, but I'd like to upload it just to have it uploaded onto my channel, and I'll have a bunch of content uploaded in the coming weeks. The CDP stands strong. 